Welcome to this short training video on how to run the AR Agent Report in NetSuite. This video is presented to you by Business Solution Partners. Today I'll show you how to access the AR Agent Report, how to change the agent options. I'll give you an overview of the summary and detail aging report. And I'll show you how to export the AR Agent Report to Excel. I have a shortcut to my AR Agent Report. But if you don't, you can access it by going to Reports, Customer Receivables, AR Aging. And this will bring you to the aging as of today. If you're running this for your month end analysis, you can change the date to the end of last month and refresh the report. And this will show you what was outstanding in AR by customer and the aging across the page. Now, in order to see what the aging is based on, you have to go into aging options. And as you can see, the aging is based on due date. So this would be the due date for the invoices. You can change it to transaction date, but typically, the aging is done or run and reviewed based on the due date. And the age is being calculated as of today's date. You want to change this to the date that you're running the report for. So we want to review this as of the end of our last month and close. And we're using 30 days intervals. So if you hit OK, you have to go back and refresh. And now this aging is based on the end of June, calculated based on the due date, and using 30 days intervals. So as at the end of last month, we had one customer with $12,000 outstanding for 60 days, and the rest of our customers had balances outstanding for more than 90 days. This report is summarized at the customer level, but if you wanted to view the details, you can click on View Detail, and this is going to give you the balances for each customer detailed by invoices. So this customer, for example, 3M, had four invoices and you have the due date for each one of them and the aging in dates and the total for the customer. You can go back to summary and this will bring you back to the summary level. You can export this report to Excel and format it. I like to change the headers to read current, current 30 days, 60 days, and usually I just export to Excel and rename the headers that way. We hope you found this video useful. If you have any questions about any of the features described in the video or need training or support with NetSuite managers or transactions, please contact Business Solution Partners at the email or phone number on the screen. Business Solution Partners is a NetSuite partner and a management and consulting firm specializing in cloud-based system implementations. Their staff members and management team include CPAs and certified solution developers with over 25 years of experience in accounting and system implementation. Visit us at bsbny.com or follow us on Twitter and other social media.